Good morning, guys. I say good morning, but I've actually been up for like an hour or so. Um, so today I'm going to be doing a vlog style type video, just kind of going through my day. Um, I'm going to go to the gym, I've got a couple of errands to run, and then I'm probably going to take the dogs to the dog park. Um, and yeah, also don't judge me, I'm aware that my eyebrows are really, really dark. I dyed them yesterday, and I left the dye on for too long, so that's what's up with that. <laughs> don't judge me. We're just going with it. So, yeah, I'm just gonna make some coffee and head to the gym. Boy, <laughs> I'm so sweaty. Literally only in Phoenix does this happen. This car is just on fire. Like, this car is literally, literally on fire in the middle of the road. What is happening? Like, oh my God. I can't even believe this right now. I'm literally awestruck. I'm like, what is going on? Like, I hope they're okay. What? It's just, it's just on fire. I don't even want to drive next to it. I'm scared it's going to blow up. It's literally leaking fluid. Like, 
The car is melting. Like literally melting. You guys. Oh my God. I can't believe this. I'm trying to figure out like, do I go? Like, do I stay? I don't have a green light and like, but everybody's stopping. So I'm like, what's happening? Okay, let's just drive over here. Okay, let's see. I'm gonna pull into this parking lot. update the people did get out um it looks like somebody is trying you guys can't see but someone's trying to put like water and stuff on oh shit there it goes there it fucking goes i can't believe this right now that like interesting stuff like this literally never happens to me so i'm like what is what is happening this car literally just blew up Really, only in Phoenix would this happen that your car overheats and it just catches on fire like what is happening oh my god I don't know if you guys can tell but I'm literally awestruck oh I feel really bad I think the owner of the car is like crying I feel sad for her dude this is insane I'm like scared, I'm so close. If it blows up, I'm like definitely scared. I can't believe this. I've never seen something like this happen before in my life. Like we hear about it in Phoenix all the time. Oh, police are here. Okay, good. Yeah, so police are here. That's good. Oh my God. It keeps blowing up, you guys. I don't even know how to like deal with this I mean I'm glad the police are here so that's good but I don't know where they went like they just drove past it so I'm like are you coming back are you not coming back Oh, here comes the fire department. I can hear the sirens. Dude, this is nuts! <clears throat> Dude, there's like oil leaking all over the street. I'm worried about the gas tank. If they don't get the gas tank, the gas tank is gonna blow up. And that's not gonna be good. And people are still driving past it, like from the other side. fire out guys oh my god all that black smoke do you see that <gasps> oh my god this is nuts I've never seen anything like this before in my life I'm speechless, honestly.
don't know if you guys can tell, but if you look really closely, this is as far as I can zoom in from where I'm sitting. I didn't want to get any closer because I wanted to be at like a safe distance in case the car did explode, you know, I'm not trying to get shrapnel to the face. But yeah, if you look really closely, um, all their windows, except for the back window, completely crashed out because of this, the fire and the pressure. All their windows are gone. That's so nuts. <gasps> Dude. Now they're just making sure that every part of the car is out. No longer on fire. They're doing a really thorough job though. That's one thing you have to say about Phoenix Fire Department. Even just Arizona, because I think this is technically Glendale Fire Department. Um, but just Arizona fire departments in general, I mean, they do such an amazing job. Fires are no joke here because it's so hot and it's so dry that once one thing catches, like it really can spread so quickly just at the drop of a hat. So really shout out goes to Arizona fire departments because they do an amazing job keeping us all safe. And especially this close to residential area, like that's a house right there. Like that's the car that's on fire. And that's someone's house. Like, can you imagine if it had spread to, like, the bushes and stuff that are literally right here? And, like, the palm trees and all those dry leaves? Like, all of this would have just gone up. But because the fire department is so on it, like, they just, honestly, they do a really, really good job. So shout out to... like it's going to start back up again in like big flames I don't know like fire science of why this is happening but Fire is completely out. This is what the car looks like now. All the windows are completely blown out, and it looks like the first two tires are burned down almost to their rims. Just another day in Phoenix, right?
Okay guys, well, I think I'm just gonna end the vlog here. Um, I had plans on filming some of the other things that I was gonna do today, but you know, I feel like nothing can really top um, a car on fire. So I'm just gonna end it right here. And <laughs> if you guys like this vlog, please give it a big thumbs up. Thank you guys for all of your continued love and support. I love you guys so much. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoy these videos. And I'll see you guys in the next one. And I love you, bye!